you guys how I make my turkey though. My stuffed turkey is going to be baked. So, Bismillah, ala barakatillah. I have a whole bunch of healthy ingredients, as you see, a whole bunch of uh, seasonings uh, olive oil, and onion, ginger, uh, garlic, parsley, and uh, lemon juice, and uh, coriander. So, Bismillah, ala barakatillah. Let's get to this magic. All right, Bismillah ala barakatillah. I am gonna make the marination for my turkey. So I have my uh, ninja machine. I'm gonna put it right here next to me. I got garlic. Can you see that? Yes. Garlic. I got uh, my ginger. I got one onion. And I got parsley and uh, cilantro. I do have the seasonings that it's already done, the butter, uh, garlic seasoning, but I prefer my own guys. And uh, lemon juice. I got my lemon, olive oil, half a cup of olive oil. I'm just gonna use this. Squeeze my lemon in. I'm squeezing all my lemon juice in there. This is going to be <laughs> Amal's turkey stuffing. And these I will use for my turkey. So don't waste anything. Everything will come in handy. As for here, guys, <clears throat> as for here, I have one tablespoon and a half of coriander uh, powder, uh, pepper. I have uh, cardamom, also one tablespoon. I got two tablespoons of turmeric, one tablespoon and a half of ginger powder and salt. So all these seasonings are gonna come inside of my by the way guys they do smell really good too so these seasonings really smell really good I got the organics the organic seasoning now I'm gonna just blend this magic I got my turkey of course I washed it and I drained it last night and uh, today I'm gonna marinate it and leave it in the, in the marination for a day for a day before I bake it you see I excuse me for that so here's my turkey guys here is my turkey and my marination is ready yo you see this guys can you see that this is my marination i'm gonna stuff it and as well marinate it inside out all right bismillah our turkey is ready to be marinated so i will remove or remove this tool Excuse me, and uh, like I said, this is a mouse marination, just like that. It's gonna go right inside, to, so I'm gonna put it right here, so all the juicy stuff don't land on my thing. Oh, can you see this flavor, this color, guys? <clears throat> Look at that. And yes, I will bake this baby here. My kids, uh, 
Thanksgiving is one of our really favorites. We do celebrate Thanksgiving. Thank God, of course, we thank God every every day, couple times a day, all the time. But it's really a special day for my family. They love and they enjoy the turkey. They love the lectures that comes with it and the food and of course the turkey. So it's a must have the turkey every Thanksgiving in this household. And I do make it my way. Uh, and I have my lemon that I squeezed, uh, that I cut. I use it also. I stuff it inside in the, in the turkey. And uh, I do have this uh, needle here that I bought with the, the turkey stuffing, but I only bought that because I need the needle. So I'm going to... so hot. Oh, then sit down somewhere. So I... So I will stuff my turkey also inside out, guys. Just like that. Uh, my my stuffing is a little thick, but I'm not giving up. So guys, I'm stuffing my turkey with my own stuffing, and there we go. And I'll just small punctures. There we go. All right, guys. Keep stuffing our turkey. Maybe we're just stuck in there. You, Mama, Mama, that is a little struggle with this uh, fresh ingredients, but it's all worth it. Can you see this? Can you make it like really close to it so they can see it? Why is this not? It's not all about breaking the case. Stuffed turkey. It is really good. The flavor will be all over the turkey. There's a little work here and it looks like a little messy, but trust me, it's worth the effort because then it's so delicious afterwards. So all you gotta do is to have a little patience. The paste is a little thick, so sometimes it cloths my uh, needle. And the thighs as well. I'll put some in the thighs. My sons like the thighs, right, Muhammad? Mm -hmm. So. Don't give up. Sometimes this needle just keeps it apart. Still have a bunch to go, guys. Yes, guys, it is a process, but look at this beauty. Look at it. It is a true beauty. And I am gonna stuff the thighs, as you see, the size. I 
and the remaining I will just marinate it leave it overnight until tomorrow guys and I will bake it for my kids normally we have fried chicken every year but believe it or not this is the same marination I do also every year this is the marination I do also every year even when we fry it but my husband is the one I was frying the chicken he's not here so I'm gonna I mean the, the turkey the bird but this year we're gonna just bake it and this is also really really good I'm gonna work with you guys and I'm gonna show you step by step how my turkey will come out so Thank you so much for watching guys. God bless you. Stay safe. Stay safe and sound. All right guys, my uh, my bird is ready. Now I'm going to marinate. I have already marinated. I'm sorry about me speaking. Now I will cover it up with my aluminum and leave it overnight in the fridge. So tomorrow It'll be time for it to go in the oven and it will be nicely marinated and trust me guys this smells already so delicious even though it's still raw because of the, all the healthy uh, ingredients uh, they do a big deal you can use the ones over the counter that you get from walmart or whatever but you can make your own seasonings as well so please try that lemon all you need is lemon juice olive oil parsley uh, gloves of a uh, couple gloves of garlic pepper salt whatever other spices that you choose so let's make this uh, meals like uh, tastes really great and have the best to our families we try to give our family the best and i try to share it with you guys so please uh, some love and support here for amal moroccan cuisine and genoa thank you guys so much see you tomorrow in the second stage of Tilt king